So at the Old Trafford, I'm joined by the super striker of Manchester United and Bulgaria, and I played against him today. How was the experience? <laughs> <laughs> How was for you the experience? So, I mean, it was lifetime. Uh, Here we go. I enjoyed it as well because, uh, as a, it's a Old Trafford. Is the pitch? Is the green? You step onto the pitch. Uh, some memory go backs and you start thinking how uh, how good it was when when I used to play but I enjoyed it because everybody put uh, effort and I hope everybody enjoyed it uh, so uh, I said to the boys as well downstairs enjoy it as much as you can because it's all Trafford so there were lots of players in your side I mean Indian players like Robin and yeah. all so how do you think because we have a huge population but uh, how do you think I mean this kind of initiative road to Old Trafford by Apollo Tires so how important is this and how can this kind of opportunity can help Indian football? Well, it's it's a great opportunity because as I said, it's Old Trafford, it's Manchester United. You come here, you step onto the legendary pitch, then now your emotions are running high, you want to perform, you want to uh, show how good you are. At the same time, you don't need to forget that this is football. And when you play football, it's about the team, it's a team sport. So you need to put your ability for the help of the team and that way you're going to benefit as well. I'm speaking from experience. I always try to put my ability, my touch, my technique, my goals for the good of the team. And because of that, I, in the process, I become a better player. In the process, the process, I want things. So my advice to, to Indian players is don't try to impress. Don't try to impress with stupid tricks and stuff. Sometimes it's not necessary. Just keep it simple as much as you can. You know. Also the process. Yeah, you keep it simple. Uh, pass and move. Pass and move. You know, I play against one of the best teams in the world back in the day, Barcelona in their prime. The only thing they were doing is pass and move, pass and move, one or two touch, one or two touch, and that's how they move and score goals. So sometimes young players especially, they're watching something on TV and they want to show the same things. But this is how you make mistakes, this is how your team suffer. You're going to have moments like this in the game, but it's not all the time. All the time is pass and move, pass and move, simple as that. What an education. And last year also, I saw uh, players coming, uh, young players coming to uh, coming to uh, list uh, Tottenham Hotspur. And they played like Kerala Blasters teams. And, and you have an Indian connection also. You have uh, yeah. been with this. So, uh, are you saying that these guys have talent, but they don't follow, follow the proper process? <sighs> they have talent, but... I said sometimes they try to impress too hard Correct. someone, I don't know who, maybe the coach, maybe the fans, maybe themselves, but if you try to impress too much, this is, is going to lead you to mistake, because again, don't forget, you're playing as a team, and if you're trying to show off too much, you're losing the ball, then the whole team must cover for your mistakes, up and down, up and down, so the moment in the game will present himself where you need to do something special, and you're going to know where that moment is, but until that moment arrives, try to play, move, pass. Football is a simple game, but for smart people. Okay. So try to be smart, and as long as you're quick here in your mind, you're going to read the game, and even if some of the opposition players are quicker than you, faster than you, if you're quick here in your brain, you're going you're gonna to outsmart them. So seeing the Indian talent and the process, what they are following, do you see, I mean, because there are 48 teams uh, in the World Cup, do you see uh, down the line from eight years or 12 years from here, do you see Indian team playing for World Cup football at any point? Well, as long as they believe they can achieve, it's difficult though, right? I'm from Bulgaria. We didn't qualify for a major tournament in 20 years. So it's a diff difficult process because every nation gets better and better and better. But as long as Indian believe they are good enough, of course they need to work hard and smart. As long as they don't complicate stuff, keep it simple, you know, because you have talented players. But obviously a, a lot of hard work and smart work needs to be done for you guys to progress and qualify and, and play even better than, than you're playing now. It's, it's the same with every country. You try to upgrade, you try to improve constantly. But again, in my mind, football is a simple game. But this is probably the hardest thing to do, to play simple. But do you see any Indian talent playing in EPL or, 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 or differently in different top class well, league in the coming years? Do you think Indian players have the ambition to go outside India to play? I don't know. You tell me. You have uh, seen players. I've seen, but when I was there, to be honest, I didn't get the feeling that they want to go outside India. But that's a mistake. You always want to dream big. 
And I give an example with myself. I am from Bulgaria. We are small, really small country. But I always dream big that I wanted to play for one of the biggest team in the world. And that dream happened. I was I play United. So again, you India young especially young Indian players, they need to dream big, but that's not enough. They need to work hard and smart. Obviously if you have a talent, it's gonna be more easy for you. But sometimes obviously talent is not enough. Sometimes hard work beats talent. So, but if you have talent and you work hard and smart, that's going to help you a lot. And I wish luck to Indian players who have a big ambitions and want to develop and someday, someday to go out of India and try their luck in some different league. You know, just test yourself, get out of your comfort zone. It doesn't matter if you fail, just try. So, one final question. Since it's a global game and uh, you pick uh, talent and uh, smart things from everywhere. Do you think you have anything, uh, I mean, uh, the world has anything to learn from Indian football also? Uh, who, do, who to learn from Indian football? world from Indian football. Ah, the Where world from Indian football. Correct. Well, at that moment, I think Indian football should learn from the biggest league in the world. Correct. Uh, so they can improve, they can try to attract high caliber players to promote the league for sure if that's the case if not concentrate on developing the young indian players uh, pay attention to how they develop help them as much as you can uh, because when an indian player go outside of india and produce a good football that's good for all of india right because if you have someone who is good and go out and play then they'll say, okay, there is a talent in India, let's go and find some more, let's go and find some more. So if one player goes out of India and do well, that's going to be great for everybody there. So important pieces of advice, but are you hopeful? Are you, uh, are, uh, how do you see India? Well, it's not up to me, it's up to the, to the young Indian players to have the ambition inside of them and to say, all right, I want to go outside my country. It's going to be difficult, it's going to be tough, challenging, but I want to do that, I want to try to go and try my best, maybe in England, maybe in Italy, maybe in Germany, you know, see how it's going to be. And if you don't have this ambition, I cannot help you. You need to have it inside of you. You need to have it inside of you. Or maybe the friends who are, uh, who are around you, maybe they can say, go on, you're good enough. Maybe your family is there to support you as well. But you, you need to have the ambition that you want to achieve something. Thank you so very much for talking. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.